Hey guys, Ash here from C4A Tech and today we've got the Xiaomi Mi 3, the Indian retail unit here that's being sold uh, via Flipkart. So let's go ahead, unbox this and take a quick look inside. So here's the box and uh, pretty similar to the Chinese branding, uh, Chinese uh, variant that we unboxed quite a while back. Nothing to the sides basically and a little bit of... Uh, uh the specs uh, right here so this is the 16 gig variant that's the only one that's being sold in india so let's go ahead take this off and uh here we have the xiaomi mi 3 so me.com yeah so let's get to the phone itself in a bit Xiaomi usually does not include a lot of stuff in the box, so uh, we've got a travel adapter with the Indian pin here and the micro USB cable. No earphones included. Uh, I guess we'll have a few booklets. So let's see. The SIM ejector pin. And we've got some, we've got the user manual. So again, that's been updated to reflect the new uh, URL, me.com. And that's pretty much it. Nothing else here. So anyway guys, let me just set this aside and uh, we'll get back to the Me 3. So here's the Me 3 itself. So let's just take this off. And we've got the serial number and stuff to the back. So I'm just going to remove that sticker as well. All right. Okay, so earpiece, front facing uh, 2 megapixel camera, sensors, notification LED, uh, capacitive keys, menu, home and back, 5 inch full HD display, me branding, volume rockers and power button to the right, uh, the speaker at the bottom, uh, micro, micro USB port, nothing to the left. So at the top we've got the 3.5mm headphone jack, a full size SIM card tray. And over here we've got a 13 megapixel uh, rear camera, dual LED flash, secondary noise cancelling microphone, me branding again. So let's go ahead, go ahead, turn this on. So uh, the Xiaomi Mi 3 is powered by a Snapdragon 800 chipset. So that's four crate 400 cores clocked at 2.3 gigahertz each, coupled with an Adreno 330 GPU and two gigs of RAM. And all this is powered by a non-user replaceable 3050 milliampere battery. Like I said earlier, this is the 16 gig variant. That's the only variant that's being sold here in India. So uh, there you go, we're up. Let me quickly run through setup. So there you go, guys. Uh, we just finished running through setup and... Uh, okay, changes from the Chinese version here. First off, the Play Store is preloaded, so Google Apps come pre-installed here. We've got a few extra apps in the form of the Flipkart app uh, and that's pretty much it. More apps here, Facebook and Kingsoft Office. I guess that was there with the Chinese variant as well. I'm not sure. Anyway, the Chinese uh, stuff that, was in, that we saw, the Chinese uh, apps like Baidu and so on are not here with the Indian variant. So that's pretty simple. We still have the security app. That's pretty nifty. We've reviewed this phone already, so I'll leave a link to that video down below in the description. So feel free to check that out for the full review. This is basically the only difference is here. Play Store comes preloaded. Uh, there's an extra Flipkart app and uh, that's pretty much it. So anyway, let me quickly open up the camera. And it's pretty much the same interface that we've seen. So going into settings, we've got, uh, all right, where do we have that? Advanced settings and turn off the simple mode to get more options. And now we've got more options. Pretty good. And this this runs on MIUI V5. Uh, that's on top of uh, KitKat 4.4.2, if I can recall correctly. Yep, 4.4.2, KitKat.
and Xiaomi generally updates their devices. Uh, they send send out bug fixes and uh, add features pretty uh, pretty often. This is a stable variant variant of the firmware that's installed. You can uh, install the developer variant. I will be doing a video on that soon. Uh, the developer variant will give you weekly updates and root access as well. So I'll also leave a link to that video down below. So I guess that's pretty much it for this quick little unboxing and hands-on video. You guys wanted me to show you what was different between the Chinese version that I reviewed and the Indian Indian variant. So that's pretty much it. That's all the difference there is. If you guys do want to see the Mi 3 compared to any other device, say an XS5 or a GNE Life S5.5, let me know in the comments below and uh, I'll probably try to get uh, that comparison video out to you as soon as possible. And if you do want to pick up a Mi 3, you can do that from flipkart.com. I'll leave a direct link down below in the description. And if you want to get Xiaomi products before they launch in India, you can get them from xiaomiworld.com. I'll leave a link to them down below in the description too. So with that being said, I guess we get to the end of this video. Thanks a lot for watching guys. If you did like this video, go ahead, give it a thumbs up. And for more videos like these, make sure you stay subscribed. So once again, that's pretty much it. Till next time, this is Ashia from C4E Tech signing off. You guys have a great day. Bye-bye now.